Hey, what's up, guys? We're playing more of the uh, franchise with the Buffalo Steel, and we're going to be going on week five here. So let's get some game time going here. Um, we just released a patch that fixed some of the blocking issues, really the instant blocking that was happening. So when players would collide into a block sequence, they would, uh, you know, they, they would sometimes, oftentimes, they would just break the tackle and break the block, whether it be the blocker breaking it or the uh, the defender doing a block shed. So, so either a pancake or a shed, I guess you could say. So we took care of that and it's nerfed completely down. So you're gonna see them, but they're not gonna be as often. And we think it's gonna help the running game. Uh, we also made some other changes to the way that like blitzers, they would come out on the outside of the, uh, of the the line of scrimmage but real quick let's get back to this we're two and two we're tied for the first place spot in the atlantic division we're controlling the buffalo steel and we're going to go ahead and play week five here i want to continue this series um we're still on the veteran difficulty that may have an effect on uh, i want to see how the running works now because in the old version as you went up in difficulty from veteran to superstar to legend it would eventually like get worse and worse and those instant block sheds would happen and it would really like just it would just nerf your running game so i really want to see how the sacks change if they get like less which we already had it kind of a they kind of seem like they were lower than they should be to begin with but i want to i want to see how the pass in the pocket uh the pass blocking in the pocket kind of evolve here and then I want to uh, I want to also see how well we can run. We're still playing on veteran mode uh, difficulty, so let's see what we could do. So I'm kind of doing some testing while I'm playing, I guess you could say, because the patch just got released. Oh no! Come on! All that dancing around—that's not cool. So we have replays turned on, we have the fan, we have everything turned on max right now, so hopefully we can... Oh, good squat. Now let's take a look at that real quick, because basically what I was trying to say was, were these guys, the outside guys in particular, they would go around in a circle and they would go after the QB. And sometimes like they would be right here and they could go right towards the QB in a, in a line, but instead they would keep going all the way down and then they would come back. So if you look at the replay now, they don't do they won't do that anymore so that was a major fix that i thought i had taken care of that before but i guess i didn't really do it thoroughly enough so that should be better now let's see do we have anything there i just want to see if it's they're blocking me well though as you can see so they're, they're doing some nice blocking on me and another thing this patch has is strength it's using skill plus strength plus strength divided by three, along with some other things too, to determine um, how well you block or, or block shed. So in this case, this guy's a 73 skill, 80 strength. This guy is an 81 strength, 83 skill, and he lost on that, on that one, right? Let's see what happens here. It looks like they both, it looks like he won and then he, he got the instant block there, which I think is interesting. It looks like he won there and then he got that right there and he was just out for the count. So I'm not sure how that happened because this guy's weak. So we need to keep an eye on those instant blocks. Um, this guy just fell to this guy here. So it just depends. I mean, you're never, you're not always gonna see the higher skill and strength player win. That's not the way it works, but they should win more often. Get him. So I apologize if I'm going to be doing some replays on this match. I do want to keep an eye on the blocking. I'm doing some testing now. The build is live though, so you guys can can have fun playing around with it. Um, you know, it's more of a tuning game patch, so it's not going to really break anything. And most people probably won't even notice unless you're 
somebody who follows the game, but it's it should be much improved. They're doing a lot of running here. Oh, good tackle. I will try to keep an eye out for it and see if we can keep up with it. see if anything happened there so they were just coming straight in on them but even there like you don't see any instant blocking blocking happening so i think it's going to really improve the line of scrimmage and remember i'm on veteran mode if you bump it up to the higher modes you'll, you're going to see better um rated players but you're still going to see of uh, the same you should still see the same exact instant block uh rate that you're seeing here that's not changing that doesn't change no matter what difficulty setting you're on so the instant block is not only taking into account the strength more than the skill but it's also like i said it's also uh it's also not affected by the difficulty so the difficulty is going to be more based off of how how much they win a blocking battle but not the instant blocks ah i want to see what happened there so you see they all went into to blocks now they didn't all last the longest but you know in this case this guy went down he's an 81 this guy's a 99 so that makes sense right his strength this guy should be a beast um let's see if that same thing happened here 87 98 97 96 so you know, and then you can see how these guys, instead of going all the way around and behind them, they, they come after them. They make a little bit of an arc and then they come after them. But that's working exactly like I expect it to work. So that's great. Now, I need to focus on this game because I don't want to lose this game. And so far they are, I'm not even running the ball, which is dumb. I should run the ball a little bit here. 99, 99. See if we can get some oh god that guy just came right through didn't he yeah oh that was bad so the crowns they probably have a really good defense because i'm seeing some some solid guy yeah their defense is stout man they they are beasts i need to be careful and that's what you want to do with this game right you you want to be able to to feel like every team is different Oh God, I just got it off. Let's go. Let's go. I'm trying to just save all my energy. Oh, great pass, great catch. I'll take it. They got through the line pretty quick there, but you see they're not just instant blocking. Even there, even in this one here, it took a couple seconds for him to break. So, you know, like a second basically, but it wasn't an instant block. But this guy is a 98 actually, and this guy is a 95. He's a 99 strength. This guy's a 95 strength, so. But you know, my line isn't the strongest line. If you look at my line, they're not bad though. They're not bad, but their defensive line is stronger than my offensive line. That was a great pass though, we needed that. I'd love to get it off the B here. I don't know why. See, I'm not even throwing it. They're coming after me. They are coming after me. See, I think that was an instant block right here. And that can still happen. It's a very low chance, but that happens. Maybe like a 5% chance. But he got it. Although I do need to look, let me look real quick. Now I'm curious because I may have to, let me see. Uh, let me go back to the, I know I'm showing you guys a couple screens here. So just bear with me. I need to check the code real quick. Cause I want to see if I go to uh wrestle break tune. 
I actually want to see. How often I'm doing this. Okay. I'm only doing this when they first get into the. To the wrestling sequence. So that's exactly what I wanted to make sure of. I wanted to make sure that it wasn't happening every single frame. And that lightning flash right before I clicked to kick it. Good tackle. I'm going to try to pick using play type. See if that helps me. Oh, God. Good tackle. One second here. All right, we're back. I'm trying to do some, uh, I have to do some work with the publisher while I'm doing this. So I'll, I'm gonna try to pause in between, but I'll see if I can do it while I play this game and then we'll keep going. Ah, great swat, Havo. Great swat. Uh, they're coming out with that. Let's do a uh, by type. Let's do a base zone. Try this out. Oh, I thought it was going past him. Good pass. All right, so we stopped him. That's what we needed to do. Uh oh, I just picked the wrong play here. Trying to run out the quarter, I see. Okay. Hey, the Good tackle. All right, let's see if we can get a running game going because I'd like to get some running tests in here as well. This one is going to be crazy because these guys are pulling like nutsos. See, they held, they held pretty well there overall. I mean, for everything that was going on, they were at least getting backed up by a couple guys. So what I don't want to see is I don't want to see like the running be overpowered. And my team is not a good running team. And this I'm playing against a really good defense here. So... But I'm getting some room to move. This feels a lot better already. And like I said, as you move up, you're going to still have a challenge because the team does get better. But those instant blocks aren't going to be the problem. They're not going to be an obstacle you have to worry about. Let's see what happens there. So see, I won. I won a couple of them there. Or at least I won one. I beat this guy. This guy's good. And my guy's not that good, but his strength's a 99. That makes a difference. So. I'll take it. Oh, come on. You got to catch that. 
That's how the Bills were last weekend. They were really struggling. I want to do an inside run. Don't want to run towards that blocker. This might be better. Run towards the middle. Oh. Oh, that guy came on a blitz. Oh, no. He just totally didn't block him. That, that was part of the, the play. They won't block on a route like that. So when they have a route that's designed for them, like those are hard. I want to see something like this. Oh, third down. That's all right. See, we got some blockers on us here. Oh, oh, that was close. That play looks so much better. So much better. That was a nice run. One thing I'm going to fix for Legend Bowl 2, if I ever get there, is the way the guys flip back and forth. Like the way the sprites. I don't know. I just saw it like that. Like, look at this. Watch. See how he just flips up and right real, real quick? How, how it's a fast little glitchy flip. I want to do it to where they can't really turn like that that quickly without at least a little bit of time in between. So some kind of a timer that says you cannot just flip back and forth like that. Because the game the game uses a 360 degree directional. That's a good kick. Okay, stop him. The game uses a 360 degree like directional uh, like directions, right? So the guy can move in any of those a full circle so but because i don't have all the sprites you know you'll see them flicker because they don't they can't go in a full 360 degree rotation for the sprite if that makes sense so i have to do something about that at some point but that's probably going to be oh that was awesome oh that was the best that was a play i'm going to have to, i'm going to have to record this or snip this out i don't know how to do that Maybe I have to make a gift real quick. Just give me one second. I gotta, I gotta copy that. That was a pretty awesome play. Um, let me, uh, let me just pause this. I'll be right back. All right, that was pretty cool. That was pretty cool. Let's see it again real quick. I just put a tweet out on it. That was awesome. I really, really like that play. And that just, whenever I see that, I kind of just giggle inside because that was uh oh that could have been a better run that was a result of all the work that i did with the ball physics i mean i spent a lot of time ironing out the ball physics and getting them to work as perfectly as possible oh no oh that was dangerous i thought for a second there that he might not be able to grab that Nice. Great play. I didn't even check how good this team's record was. That would be kind of cool to see here or see somewhere, like just see their record. You can't see that now in the game. Hey, I'm getting yards, which is nice. It's nice to get some running going and not have to worry about those instant blocks happening every single time. I actually got one there as a blocker, I think. This guy just got toasted. 99 strength, 95 skill. 95 strength, 98 skill, but... Somehow he got toasted, but for the most part, they're blocking now, which feels so much better. Oh, good block. Good block. Let's go. I'm telling you, the game's feeling nice. The game is feeling nice, my friends. I'm happy with it right now. That's for sure.
Ooh. All right, so we are up 14 to three. And uh, really, I don't see any major uh, penalties happening from the change we made. Like, like sacks are still happening and the running game doesn't feel overpowered. Now, like I said, I am playing on the veteran difficulty. So, you know, that's, that is, uh, not the hardest. I actually moved up from Superstar because Superstar was harder before we made the AI changes in the, in the previous patches. See, that guy just went right through, but see, nobody blocked him because this guy's on a route. He's not, he's not worried about that guy. He's pulling over and that's just part of the play. So you have to be careful what you play, what, you know, what, what you play, what, what, what play you pick. I mean, uh let's see so it is third and 14. i don't love this play call so let me just grab this guy and bring him out here oh he's gonna run it jeez they're trying to run that clock out i guess call a timeout this team's not very good from what i'm seeing so let's take a look at their squad i mean they're not bad they're not bad at all they're actually pretty solid <laughs> Just one sec, I need to do something. All right. Yeah, I mean, we're playing pretty well and uh, these guys are a pretty good team. But like I said, the the changes to the to the difficulty. Oh no, another fumble. Oh my god, that's two fumbles on my special teams. Come on, guys. Dang. That's another thing. We we have given the ball up twice. And I'm still beating them 14 to three, so I have to be happy about that. Oh, that was dangerous. Oh, why did I dive? See what they're coming out with here. Oh, ah. See, sometimes I try to pick a guy, and I and I thought he's gonna let me pick this guy, but as you can see right here, he picked the closer guy. I hate when I do that. So whenever you're changing players like that on defense, and I mean this goes for any game. Look at this guy's name, Javiero. Javiero Emch. That's funny.
Yeah. Good tackle. Yeah, when you switch your guy on defense, you need to be able to like let it go and let the autopilot kick in so you know who you're picking before you throw a guy off the play. Because if you throw a guy off the play, it's like um Come on. Oh, they're going for a field goal here. Wow. Surprised they're not going for it. Time, do not fumble. I want to go for one more play. See if we can get a Hail Mary. The, the bad part about this is that we got the ball first. So that's the only thing that's not good. Take a look at who we got here 93 speed, 84 speed, 91 speed. I think I'm going to go to LB. I'll go to B, see if I can get in there. Oh my God. Bad defense right there. All right, let's keep going. Sorry for the choppy video. I'm doing like two, three, two or three things at once here. So, uh, my apologies. I want to get this game in before I have to run out. They're probably going to try to run. They, they've been running it a lot. So, yeah, I think they're going to run here. See if we can stop them. I was all over that one. This game plays awesome. I love this game. I, I really do. Like I, 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 I've been, I've been working on this game. Like you guys know, you hate when I say it, but I've been working on this game for a long time, and I still love the game. Ah, uh, get him! All right, we need to stop here. They're coming back, so I need to be careful. Pinch nerve in the neck. like this play without even looking at their play but I'm gonna need to give them some help here good tackle great tackle fourth down the defense held their ground fast bender all right now let's not fumble I mean geez please Get out of the way, ref. Come on. The one thing I don't like about this play is that this guy right here is going to pull 
I think. Oh god, I gotta, I gotta do better. I gotta do a better job than that. I don't have time to watch replays. Uh, but so far, I'm liking the changes that have been made. I don't have anything negative to say, and if the game just feels so nice. That was actually a pretty good pass. Uh-oh. Oh, he caught it. I thought I had a perfect punt. Oh my gosh. I whiffed on that one. Yeah, he's recorded zero touchdowns. Thanks. Thanks for the uh, stat. All right, let's see. This looks like a run to me all day long. My team's getting stronger and stronger every week. Thank you. I did not want to touch him. I don't want to mess up that tackle. No, thank you. Great tackle, Hobo. I almost like jumped right past him. Keep that clock ticking. Do not catch that. We'll take a touch back. Tight game. Wow, this is a power run. Oh, I almost squeezed through. I'm not running the best, but that's also a byproduct of my team not being that good. Come on, man. Totally missed the block. Totally missed the block. God, they're like, they're playing well right now. I mean, they're going to go to X, B, or Y. X, B, or Y. Come on, B. Come on, B. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. He blew it, folks. He blew it. <laughs> Woo! Touchdown, baby. Let's go, Buffalo. Woo! Three for three. Exactly what I like to see, folks. Hmm, I always hit it on 90. I can never get it to 100. Somebody get him. Those scare me. These guys have been getting nowhere on the ground. We are we are showing up deep, guys. We're showing up like men. Don't love this play. Mm. This one I don't like even more. Oh, good. Oh, look at that juke move right into a tackle. Let's go base man. I'm liking picking the plays by type. Somebody get him. All right, fourth quarter. Let's go. All right, we almost got this one in the bag. Put us at three and two. Hopefully Miami loses and we can get, we can get in front of him. 
We're running this back. Do not fumble the ball. Thank you. Ah. It's hard to run against this team. That's for sure. That is for sure. I'm not a good running team to begin with. And I'm running against a really, really, really stout defense here. Ah, I was hoping I could give him a shoulder. Oh my God, I threw that into heavy, heavy, heavy traffic. No good, no good. I'm not kicking the ball well. I need to take my time on those punts because they're getting a lot of yards. Good tackle. They've gotten pretty good field position, but man, we are holding them. I like picking zone blitzes. Uh, not in this case, though. They're coming out with that. Let's try to play some soft coverage here. Ooh, that was close. Come on, guys. I had three guys there. And I didn't want to touch it because I didn't want to get in, in the way and interfere with that. Oh. That one hurt. Man, they cannot run on me right now. That's for sure. coming from oh we're just they're just they're just getting out of the way that's just part of that play you have to be careful when you pick those running plays because if they're if they're just rolling out like that you better have a speedy running back or else you're going to be in trouble oh good tackle open field now what are they going to do here that's the question because they're down by a lot. Wow, they're gonna kick it? I guess they think they have enough time. Wow, I thought that was gonna go on in the end zone for a second. I was hoping for that. I don't know why they didn't go for it there. That's interesting. I mean, they're down by what? 14 points? 15 points. So... Whoa! No! Oh my god, that's the third fumble in the game. Are you kidding me? What is this guy doing? You can't fumble like that. Thought that was going out of bounds. Watch the 
Nice play, defense. Nice play. Way to go after him. Uh oh, this is not looking good. Calling timeout, so I don't know what they're waiting for. Oh, my God, did he catch that in the end zone? Wow, that was close. That was close. They're testing us here. Oh, great tackle. Great tackle. Great tackle. Who was that? Who was that? Nice. Bergman. Thank you. Gosh, we needed that one. Come on, man. You gotta call that. No chance. No chance. Too bad. So sad. Now we run this ball and do not fumble, please. God, I just blew up my guy there. Boom. See, that does happen still, which happens in real life. That's the equivalent of like a swim move. You know, you just got underneath the guy and I don't mind that, but I just don't want that happening all the time. It's a great run right there. Hold the ball. That was a sweet little run. That was a good looking play. I like that play a lot, a lot. But see on that play, my blockers held up at least enough. So you have a chance. I don't know why I just did that. I think we could just call this a game, guys. I think we could just do victory formation and just walk out of here with a W. I'm, I'm happy, I'm happy. All right, so that's it. So we're gonna end it here. I gotta get going, but we got our last game in. So we're gonna have a, uh, we're gonna have week five in the books. We're gonna be what? Three and two, so we have a winning record now. We're breaking our 500 record. We're gonna take a quick look at the stats, player of the game, and then we'll call it a game. So we got out of this one. They started coming back on us. Three turnovers, that's not good. That's not good. Three fumbles too, which I'm not really happy about. But we'll take the win. It's always tough. I I'm curious how good this team is, though. Complete a three-game winning streak. Thank you. Yeah, that was a pretty tight game. Rushing yards, we had 12. They had negative six. So the rushing was not good at all. Uh, player of the game is Dakota for sure. No, oh, Hudson. Wow. Yeah, he had some big plays. Okay. Let's just take a quick look at stats. Wow, beast of a game. Three TDs, no interceptions. He did not play well over there. These Russian yards were really bad. Um, but we're going to have to figure that out next time. But I got I to gotta get going. So I want to take a look really quick at how the rest of the week goes. 
and then uh, take a look to see if Miami won or lost here. Oh, we have the player wire again, so Let's see if we have a opportunity to pick up a guy. Okay, here we go. So the Liberty have offered to trade Gabriel Longoria halfback 85 to the steal. And we're going to give, um, we could give this guy. So we have 74, 69, or seven, let me just see all these things here. So the, the weakest guy is this dude. He's 29 years old. Longoria is 25. This is a great trade. Great trade. Um, let me just take a look at my roster real quick. Oh yeah, this guy, this guy's gonna take over my I might want to get rid of Thompson, to be honest with you, because Thompson's really upset. And I'd rather have this dude. So I'm getting rid of Thompson. That's it. I'm getting rid of Thompson, I think, guys. Who is this guy they're trying to why are they trying to trade this dude? Damn, 8.8 .8 million though. That's not good. Huh. I'm surprised they're getting rid of him because he's pretty happy. So, oh, but their team chemistry is not ranked the best. Yeah, their team chemistry is not good. So because of that, players want to leave. That's the problem. Ooh. So yeah, we're taking them. We're gonna we're gonna give up Thompson. This is so cool. This is the coolest part of the game. I'm sorry. This just is that you get this like this. You don't gotta worry about sitting there and saying, "Will you take my offer?" And just like cheesing the computer to to accept your offer. This is great. This was a great idea. Thanks to all those guys on the team that helped out with the franchise and designing some of this stuff. It's, it, it turned out really nice. So we're gonna take Thompson here and uh, we're gonna improve our morale too. And we're gonna get a much better halfback. So we will take him and uh, we just improved our squad. <laughs> Woo! Nice. So week six is next. Um, let's take a look really quick at the newspaper. Most passing yards and international incidents to Dakota. Let's go. Let's take a quick look at a couple things before we, uh, let's go ahead and save here. Actually, let's cancel. What I want to do first is make sure that I auto depth this one here. We want Longoria to be number, oh, he's number one. Look at this guy. He's a beast. Our entire running game just had a change. He's only 25 years old. Only problem with him is he gets paid a lot of cash. Let's see him in the photo here. Where is he? Number 30. Longoria. I like him. I wonder if the game is smart enough to recycle numbers when you do a trade like that. That is something that I'm not 100% sure I ever did. I think I did. I don't see a problem here. Um, that's something I want to look at, though. So we're looking good there. The other part I wanted to look at were the standings. So we're three and two. Oh, they lost. So they're they're two and two. Actually, did they play? They must have had a bye week. Yeah, they must have had a bye week last week. Week five. Yeah, they did. Okay, cool. So if we take a look at um we could do it other ways. We could do it like this. Who we just play? We just played Tennessee, right? The Crowns? The Kings, I mean. Yeah, they're two and three. They were two and two before. They're not bad, but we beat them up, but they almost came back. Okay, so that's it, guys. That's that's the video. Um, we'll, uh, we'll do this again. This is a lot of fun. I'm having a great time. I'm going to go ahead and save real quick, and then uh, we will uh, see you next time. Thanks for watching. Peace.